Hey, it's Miss Fisher. This week we're going to use a shoe to create a fish. So you need to find a shoe that you can trace. If you don't have one um, that you can trace or you don't want to, then you can just try to draw the outline of a shoe. Um, but I have my shoe right here and I'm going to start with my pencil. I'm just gonna trace the outline of it. Cause I don't wanna get any marker on here. So I suggest tracing first in pencil so that you don't get your shoe dirty. All right, so I have a little outline. Then I'll go ahead and go over it with my marker. And now we're gonna turn this into a fish. So what we need for a fish is we need some fins. So I'm gonna draw a top fin and a bottom fin. I'm gonna draw a tail. I don't have a lot of room, so I'm gonna make it a short tail. Um, and then I'm going to give him some gills and a face. Do you see how the fish is starting to come together? Now from here you can add whatever kind of patterns or designs you want on your fish. So if I want mine to have hearts, then I'll just draw some hearts. I think I'm going to color my whole fish yellow. No, it's not the neatest coloring, but I'm just trying to go a little quick. I'll go back in later and fill in all the space. Color in my fins. And then I think I might add just some polka dots to give it a little more variety. Now, like I said, you can design the inside of your fish however you want. We really just want the shape of the shoe to show. If you're doing this on auto draw, then do not put your shoe up to your computer. You could just, just try to get the same shape it's almost like a bean shape. Now, if you want to from here, you can do some background stuff. Like I might have some bubbles coming out of my fish's like mouth. Um, if you want to draw some more fish in the background, you could. And there you go. Then you just have to submit it to me through Teams, Class Dojo, or email. Have fun with your shoes.